It's one player, two player. Put controller in and they turn the power button on and say, Power on! Power on, everybody. Welcome back to Jet Set Radio Future. How y'all doing? Uh, I've, I've had a blast with this shit. Sorry, I had a burp. Is, oh, you're good, man. Uh, I had a burp in the mic. I smell <laughs> me. I had a burp in the mic. My bad. <laughs> man, I have hiccups. I love the smell of man. Have you ever, what, go go back, you shit. Hokage? Oh, I can't go there. Uh, maybe that way. Then? Um, have you ever have you ever watched Family Guy for the episode where they go back in time with uh Mort or uh, uh Chris or, or whatever it is? Uh, yeah. And 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 <laughs> they go back in time to the the woman who wrote Pride, Bride and Prejudice, <laughs> and 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 be like, we just came here to let out all of our thoughts, <laughs> and they start fighting. She comes up and she goes, Oh yeah! Give me that! Oh, I love the smell of men! <laughs> <laughs> I fucking... That shit cracks me up. Fucking love it. Woo! That shit's gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna tell you something else, but that fucking took my, like, entire oh my attention. God. <laughs> really solid 30 minutes. Solid 30 seconds, whatever. Oh, man. And we're back! I, I'm stop! <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, yeah, oh, I was gonna say I love doing this with you. It's 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 a lot of fun. <laughs> I already said that. There was someone that followed that. What was it? Too Fuck bad you. I won't be on here that long. Goodbye. I'm just kidding. Dude, I I look forward to it. Look we can absolutely fit it with your schedule. I look forward to these next three months. My manager can my manager can schedule it out. <laughs> Present and accounted for. What am I? Where am I going? Where are you going? Rotate the map. Uh, Rotate a little bit more. Change I the map. I think. Uh oh. Well, I already, I already did. Where did I come from? Ah, oh, fuck. I do apologize. Okay, I think I have to go to <laughs> Dogen Zaka Hill. Yeah, I think it's over here, right? I think so. No. Dude, what the fuck does this game want me to do? Uh, oh, I did Dokensaka Hill, so I don't need to go to Do- Fucking- Dokensaka Hill, welcome back. Oh, I haven't done r whatever that is. <gasps> is this that really weird level that's really weird? What? That was super descriptive. <laughs> what? You'll see. Let's see it. Rokako Dai Heights. I'm sure this is sound. Everybody will be fine. This is Rokaku Dai Heights. Yeah. An abandoned hill in time. This has a really weird Easter egg in it. I'm not going to be able to pull it off, but I'll show it to you after this. Oh, I know what it is. I know exactly what it yeah, is. Yeah, it's a little little clock. Yeah, and it's just there. It's just Nobody there. Nobody knows what Nobody it stands for or anything. Nobody knows what you have to do. And yeah, do it in under two minutes. Yeah, and that's it. And I, I've never been able to pull off, and I have no interest to do it in this episode. You should try to do it. Shut up. You don't eat breakfast. Didn't you just kill that man? I pushed uh, him woman. off a cliff, but apparently he's fucking Superman. So, I mean, your guess is as good as mine. Burn it! Oh. <laughs> I'll just uh take what I can get. Oh. Ah, oh, not what I wanted. <laughs> go backwards. There you go. There we are. Go zoom it. Oh, go crazy. Oh. All right, cool. Oh, my pant leg is on fire. <laughs> I got really warm all of a sudden. <clears throat> How you doing, Magic? <clears throat> Howdy. You're pretty. You're pretty. Pretty hot. Oh, shit, fucked it up. <laughs> <laughs> I uh. You better stop. You better stop! There's this guy. Here we go. Here we go. I absolutely hated. We're not gonna talk about him. Uh, like his name. We're not, gonna, we're not gonna point out his name or what ah. it looks like. We're give me gonna, a. Give me the, the letter. Does, give me the letter. No, no, no. Give me the letter. Because I don't know his name. Oh. What is he? He was a like? customer. He always came oh. through. Oh. Uh, there was always a problem with everything, and he always wanted something for free. I know who. And he, and he had fingernails that were like. He was very feminine. Yeah. I know. Yeah. And it's like, okay, be feminine, that's fine, but uh, if you could stop trying to fucking steal our food, that'd be great. 
I didn't like him. I uh, didn't like him either. He's kind of petty. I I'm not gonna lie. All right, 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 right. Right, for every for customer it. out there, all right, all right, for every customer that goes to fast food, these guys are going through a lot. Um, they have a lot of things to do. They have uh, the employees have a lot of things to do. They have to they have to work their ass off to get you the food that you ask for. And when you cause a lot of trouble, when you cause something that would cause stress to the employees, then it's just mixing up a bad recipe, a disaster, because you're kind of you're kind of fucking up and you're kind of acting like a dick. I'm not saying everybody. I mean, like does even that. from my perspective, I was trying my best with what I Honestly, had. Honestly, like because everyone... you walk in and it, and it can be as bad as, as our scenario where we would walk in and it's like, okay, what are we out of today? Yeah. Like because there was always something we were out of. Yeah. And that was the most infuriating process when you walk in and you know you're going to be out of something regardless of whether or not you want to be. Yeah. Because somebody fucked up and it's his job not to fuck up, but he fucked up because he's being lazy. Mm -hmm. And it was the worst. I absolutely hated it. Yeah. That's why I will never work fast food again in my life, but I'll probably end up working at McDonald's regardless. Unfortunately, that's kind of the sad case. I would rather not work at fast food, but I mean... I'd rather not as well. I was like, Wendy's was the first fast food I've ever had. Now, the reason... It was every place I worked. Now, the reason I don't suggest one works at Wendy's in you... The song is so bad. The reason why I suggest... <laughs> What's up? There's a hole right there. Oh, I thought you just went through it. You glitched yeah. in. But continue what you were gonna say. Um, I was gonna say that uh, I suggest you not work at Wendy's in Utah because I know that there there are better Wendy's depending on the state. Definitely. Um, but just don't work at Wendy's in Utah because the managers don't give a shit. And the management of Utah just doesn't give a shit about the employees or the service or anything. They're willing to cut edges and corners wherever they can, yep. um, which is just garbage. It leaves you in a garbage environment. It puts you in a garbage mood. Yep. And I, I absolutely hated it. I love the people there, most of them anyway. Uh, mind you, however, I, I've had the uh, the unluck. I don't know what to call it. The terrible luck, I guess, would be. Oh! oh, oh. The terrible luck of uh, accidentally, well, not accidentally, of inconveniently experiencing the bad versions of everybody all at once. And those bad versions of them uh, pushed me away of their own accord. And I kind of just hit this point of, okay, whatever. That's what sucks sometimes. I was like, you know what? I'm probably better off without this particular part of my life anyway. Because uh, there was a certain somebody that kept on asking to join my channel as the co-host, and I was like, no, you, you genuinely like, he had he had drug problems. And that was me. No, I'm just. <laughs> and now I'm here. And I just, uh, Hello. I kept on saying no to him, and he just kept on. There, there was always a moment where he was like, there, there was always didn't matter what conversation we were having. There was always a moment to bring up the fact that he wanted to join. And it was kind of annoying. I mean, mind you, however, I could tolerate it because, you know, I've tolerated worse. <clears throat> but, I mean, after he found out that I wasn't going to let him on no matter what, uh, a whole other side of that person suddenly showed up. That just didn't exist until that moment. And it was kind of sad because he's a pretty chill dude up to that point. This turned into a really existential breakdown episode. <laughs> It's kind of, it's a little depressing, but hey. Oh, I probably should have just, oh, I can just do this. Oh, oh never mind. Oh, oh, that doesn't put me anywhere. Wait. Yeah. Okay, we got 57. Wow. Oh, I like how he dances. That was neat. Yeah. How do I get up? Oh, oh, I thought you glitched. No. 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 No, not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. So where do I... Where do I go? Where do I go? Hey. Where do I go? I don't know. I wasn't oh. paying attention to all what you were doing. Oh, 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 oh. Not at all. I don't like it. Not at all. Not at all. Spray cans, though. That's what the problem. 
Oh. Hello. Oh, oh, power up. We'll find out what this, what Ride has to say. He has big bobs. <laughs> oh. That is gorgeous. Be <laughs> 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 again.